Wow, you were almost in a dirt bike race? Yeah, yeah, I filled out most of the paperwork, too. You are the coolest guy I have ever met. Yeah. Hey, Brian, you see that magazine cover right there? See who's on it? Yeah, that's Jessica Alba. Yeah, you want to know a secret, buddy? What? I would do her. Really? Oh, yeah. I just wanted you to know a little bit about who I am. Thanks for the milk, Carl. Lois and I are stocking up for a very special anniversary evening. And I'm not sure that 5% discount was worth checking in here on Facebook. Ew, Meg, don't like that. Anyway, to celebrate, we thought it would be fun to recount the three greatest love stories ever told. We'll begin with the tale of Helen of Troy, the face that launched a thousand ships. Which is the poetic way of saying Helen of Troy was thick, though. Hey, how come you're always here by yourself? Are you like a bitch or something? No, I have friends. Oh. Well, you should bring some of them in here. Any of them have braces? Yeah. I love braces. My mom has them. Hey, who the hell are you? Oh, what the hell's that creepy little thing? Well, I'm not Yoda. Okay, I'm Yoda. You're Yoda? You're the one that Obi-Wan sent me here to find! Will you teach me the ways of the Force? No, I will not teach you the ways of the Force. Okay, I'll teach you the ways of the Force. Ever see the movie Cruel Intentions? No. Oh, Selma Blair and Sarah Michelle Gellar make out? It's pretty hot. 47 minutes, 16 seconds in. Hey, what the hell, man? What? You just made eye contact with me through the crack in the door, like, for a long time. Just seeing if anyone was in there. Yeah, but you knew that after half a second, but you kept looking. You're gross. You're a gross guy. Hey, Mac, you here for the expired hot dogs? Have you guys ever seen Jim Henson's Labyrinth? No. Have you ever seen the Channel 5 News? No. Uh, Labyrinth has teenage Jennifer Connelly. Channel 5 News has file footage of pills being sorted. Some people think Jennifer Connelly's old now and that her hands look like two bags of snakes. I think that's bogus. I don't think we have much in common. All right, we are buying none of these. Please put them back, but we'll take one of these. Oh, uh, Charleston Chew. Good choice. You know about putting them in the freezer? Yeah, I know about the freezer. There's nothing you can teach me. Thank you. I want to testify. I want to testify. Well, come forward, dear brother, and testify. I used to be a soda pop guy. Then I switched to the bottle. Now I don't leave my couch, and I've seen every movie ever. You name a movie, I've seen it. Meet Dave. Seen it. The Iger Sanction. Seen it. Donovan's Reef. Seen it. License to Drive. Definitely seen it. Okay, just remember to act confident. You're gonna do great. You look real grown up. Ah, uh, yes, I'd like to buy some alcohol, please. Okay, can I uh, see your ID? Oh, I don't have one. You don't? No, it's me, Chris. Oh, hey, Chris. Hey, Carl. Can I buy some alcohol? No. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, hey, you know what's a great movie? The Reaping? Yeah. Um, why are you dressed like John Lithgow? For the moment, there's no way out. No way out. Great film. Sean Young, Naked in the Limo. Well, maybe the storm will let up soon. I don't know. It's a hard rain. Christian Slater, Morgan Freeman. We just want the money. We should have known this weather was coming. There's been three days of thunder. Tom Cruise, race cars. Those are my bed sheets. Where is the chase and how do I cut to it? Wow, you're smart. W what? All right, now, let's go over what we've learned. Naked chicks, best? Rebecca De Mornay in Risky Business. Good. Worst? Kathy Bates in About Schmidt. Correct. I also would have accepted the rotting old woman in The Shining, but Kathy Bates is probably worse. The only thing we really sell here are these little packets of weird vitamins that vaguely suggest they help you in the bedroom. Performance and stamina for men. I know what that means. He's dead. Nice. I'm really worried. See, look, is that normal? Ha uh, ha, uh, sir, sir, your employee is exposing himself to me. But, Dad... You got a lawsuit on your hands, mister. Whoa, whoa, okay, look, look. If you'd be willing to forget this whole thing happened, I'll give you this gas card. Unlimited free gas for a year? Just because I threatened to sue you? Well, that, and you're not the worst-looking guy who's ever come in here. That's what I wanted to hear. What do you see? I see a woman draining your bank account and... Running off with a real estate agent. That is a bitch, you see. Looks like I'm all alone. Well, hey, that's all right. I watch a lot of movies. I can just use my imagination. Hi, Carl. Hey, Bear. So, um, in the bear world, are, like, pandas your version of interracial children? Yeah, pandas aren't something I agree with. They're cute, though, right? Just when they're babies. What's going on, man? Are you pregnant? Now, my wife watched that food documentary. And you should never ask that unless you're sure, by the way. Well, maybe we should take a look at that letter. Yeah, I'd like to see that, because I can read it just like everybody else. 
and the charade continues. I asked Peter what he got on his SATs. He said mayonnaise. All right, you guys like impressions? Here's that guy Bob from Bob's Burgers. Hi, I'm Bob from Bob's Burgers. How about that show Archer? You watch that show Archer? Here's that guy Archer. Hi, I'm Archer from that show Archer. Now, what if those guys met? Hey, Archer, it's Bob. Hey, Bob, it's Archer. Thank you. Hey, Carl. Hey, can I get a couple of scratch-off lottery tickets? Oh, sure, Brian. Oh, Brian, can I do one? I love scratches. Well, all right, maybe just one. Cherry. Another cherry. Oh, come on, one more, one more. Thanks, Carl. Yeah, you're welcome. That was fun. See you later. Hey, uh, thanks for letting me be Yoda. Yep.